Hello everyone. Welcome to the programming geek. Today we will learn inheritance in PHP. Inheritance is a key feature of object oriented programming. Let's see what is the use of inheritance. Consider we have a class as person. It has properties as name, address, email and mobile number. Now let's consider we have to create one application for the customer management. In that we have to create one class as customer. But customer has the same attributes as person, class, as name, address, email and mobile number. Let's see. Here is the person class and the customer class. The customer class has the same attributes as class person. But it has additional feature or additional attribute as customer number or ID. So instead of writing all the things same as the person in the class customer, we will just inherit, inherit person class into customer class and we will write additional single attribute as customer name, uh, customer number or ID. So we don't have to write all these things again as name, address, email and mobile number. We will just inherit all the properties of person into the class customer. So this is the use of inheritance we can use in this way. Let's see how to use inheritance in PHP. First I have created index.php page. In that I have written open PHP tag and close PHP tag. First we have to create one class as class and then class name as let's say parent class. In that I will create one variable public I will declare it as public. Class name we can give anything. For this tutorial I have given parent class you can give anything class name we can so we will create a variable I will declare it as public let's say variable 1 I will assign some string and class variable Parent class will also contain one function. It's a function and function name will give parent function. This function will print the web string. Mm, let's say parent class function so our parent class is ready now we want to create a child class so we will get child class but I want the features of parent class in the child class so the simple way is to copy all the thing and write again it in the child class but this increases the code in object oriented programming the another way is the inheritance we can inherit all the properties of parent class into the child class instead of writing all the things again so we will do the inheritance instead of writing it so I want the variable one and the parent function in the child class. I will not write it again. I will just use inheritance. So for inheritance in PHP we have to use extends keyword and then class name. Which class we want to extend class name of. I want to extend the parent class. Just we don't write anything in the child class now. So but I want to use the properties of parent class into child class so I will create one object of child class let's say obj1 
object one for creating object we have to use new keyword and then class name the object we want to create the child class after that we want to call the variable for calling the variable or function using object we have to use arrow sign after the object name so the variable name variable one variable one remember when we declare the variable we have to use dollar sign but when we use variable using object or the this keyword we don't have to use the dollar sign we just write variable name okay let's see okay. Okay, we are not echo it we are not use echo keyword we have to echo it okay this for yes i am a parent class variable this is putting this step parent class variable we are called it using child class object but the child class object child class does not have any variable or function but it has it inherited the parent class so this feature of parent class is inherited in child class let's call the function object 1 and then function name let's say parent function I'll use some space. Here is parent class function. So in this way, we are implemented inheritance in PHP. First, we have created parent class. In that, we have created variable declared as public, and then parent function, and then we have created second class as child class, and inherited the parent class using the extends keyword. and then created the object of child class and then called the variable use the variable using the child class object and then we have called the parent class function as parent function using the child class object if you like this video please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for more videos thank you